Hi, this is Ken Lerette. I'm uh, known as Nevada Ken on the Discord channels for Trade Devils Indicators. And I want to make a quick video here on how to install a lag timer and also installing the Meinberg Network Time Protocol tool. These are both free tools that can help you solve your, or at least attempt to solve your lag issues with NinjaTrader, particularly when you're running um, NASDAQ futures or micro NASDAQ futures. Those tend to produce the worst lag of all the uh, futures tools. So I'm going to start with uh, the lag timer. I first want to show you a market analyzer that's uh, already started here. You can see I don't have any way to see on this analyzer whether I've got a lag problem or not. So the first thing we'll do is install a lag timer that will help us determine if we have an issue. So to do that, <clears throat> I'm going to search in the search tool for Ninja Lag Timer. And the first result that comes up for me is uh, support at Lilu Trading, uh, which is a prop firm some of you may be familiar with. And we can open this page and get a free copy of uh, lag timer. So I'm going to double click this right here and I'll put this link in the um, in the description on this video. Now I've downloaded I believe that tool and it's right here in my download folder NT8 lag analyzer zip and we don't want to unzip it just leave it zipped. Go to your control center in Ninja, which I already had open. I have Ninja open. Go to Tools. Go to Import. Go to Ninja Script Add-on. Click that, and it will open your download folder automatically. Double click the lag analyzer zip file that we just downloaded. It tells me here that it has successfully imported them. Click OK. Now I should be able to go back to my market analyzer, right click on columns or select columns now you'll see this option up here it says NeuroStreet. That's uh, the uh, program that we just installed. Double click that and double click NS Data Lag Timer. Click OK. And now that appears as an extra column in our market analyzer. Right click on anywhere in an open space and go to Columns. Go to the lag timer and just click up a couple of times. You can build the market analyzer however you like, but I like to have the lag timer as my first column. And you can see that now it is my first column, and I have over a one second lag, which is terrible. That's uh, untradeable because your orders will be delayed getting to Ninja. So we're going to try to fix that. Uh, first let me show you how you would sync your clock. Uh, we're going to go to the settings menu. Just uh, search in your um, program search bar for settings. Open that up. Click the hamburger menu. Go down to time and language. Go to date and time. And you'll get this window. It gives you an option down here that says sync now. And what this will do is sync your system clock with, notice this, this is very important, it will sync your system with the time.windows.com time server. Now that time server is okay, but it's not as good, it's not the one that uh, the Chicago Merck uses to set their clock with. And all the quotes that come out of CME are time stamped. So I'm going to click Sync Now. 
and this will sync my clock with the Windows time server. And now we can look at the uh, data lag timer that I just installed, and instead of being over a second, it's now 0 .07 seconds, which is excellent. And that's tradable. And if you like, you can stop here and just manually go into this date and time window and sync your system clock with the Windows server anytime you like. And a lot of people do this and it's an acceptable way of going. However, your clock on your computer will eventually become out of sync with this uh, server and you will begin to see more and more lag. <clears throat> now I want to stop here and, and tell you that the clock synchronization is not the only issue that can create lag. Uh, during uh, times of, of uh, high market activity, particularly with the NASDAQ and the micro NASDAQ, when there's a rush of data coming into your system through the internet, you can have lag no matter how good your internet connection is, <clears throat> no matter how good your computer is, uh, you may see lag. And this has to do with the way that NinjaTrader built their system, the way they coded it up. They use single threads for each instrument. So all the NASDAQ chart calculations will go through one thread on your processor. All the micro NASDAQ uh, chart calculations will go through a different thread on your processor. Um, we have asked them, I've asked them, and many people that I know have asked Ninja to rebuild their software to multi-thread the incoming data and calculations rather than single thread. They're aware of the issue. They may eventually provide that fix. So what we've done here so far is good. And I'll give you a way now to auto-sync so you don't have to manually sync. Just be aware this may not fix all of your issues. So now I'm going to show you how to eliminate the need to ever manually sync your computer. And the way we do that is uh, using a free program called the Mindberg Network Time Protocol. And the way you find that is just search for it in your search bar. It'll take you to a results page. The top one in my search is the Mindberg website. Click on that and you want to click on um, NTP download here. Get that page up and scroll down not too far until you see this download. This is the uh, network time protocol for Windows. We want to download this. And here's what it will look like in your download folder. It says NTP 4.2.8p, etc., etc. This is not a Ninja program. This is a Windows program. So what I'm going to do is just double click it and install it. And we're going to be very careful as we do this process to make sure that we select the right time servers. Installing the program is simple, just like any ordinary Windows program installation. Double click on the execution file, agree to the terms, on this window click next, this window accept the default programs and click next. It will install the programs. But then this this window is very important that you do this correctly. Click create an initial configuration file with the following settings. So check that checkbox. And then uh, a predefined public NTP server needs to be selected. Drop this window down scroll all the way to the bottom where it says North America if you're in North America if you're elsewhere in the world select your location for North America I'm going to select United States if you're in Canada obviously select Canada once that's in the correct window uh, then click next and it will finish the installation do you want to review the generated configuration file we can Click Next. Now it's starting the service. Click Finish. And now the software is installed. I'm going to close my file folder. 
I'm going to go back over here to the uh, to the settings system settings menu and show you what that's uh, done for you. Click the hamburger menu. Drop down to time and language, date and time, and the sync now button that we used before is still available. But watch what happens when I click it. It just spins. Time synchronization failed. And the reason is we've installed an automatic syncing program now. So get that gone. And you can see now my lag is even better than it was before. It's down to 0 0.01 seconds. And the benefit is that I'll never have to sync my computer again. Again, uh, the CME uses different time servers than the Windows time server that you would ordinarily sync your Windows clock to. We're now on better time servers and we never have to do this manually again. So I hope that's helpful to you. Uh, again, my handle on Discord in the Trade Devils uh, group is Nevada Ken. Feel like you can uh, message me if you have any questions, I'll be happy to help you.